How did we get here? Scientists have predicted that the Earth will become uninhabitable in 20 years. The year is 2194, and my crew has been sent on a mission across the cosmos to find a planet capable of sustaining human life. This planet is beautiful. Almost too beautiful. Exploration. Humans have been guided by the necessity of exploration since the beginning of time. Above, three beams of light from the ternary sunrise shine through the fleeting clouds as snowflakes glimmer and paint the crisp air. There's a cave opening ahead. Crystals peeking through the entrance shine and shimmer to create vibrant prisms of color. And the necessity of exploration strikes again. Could it be true? Has the planet that will prevent the extinction of humans finally been found? Birds, resembling that of ice sculptures, swirl and sing as they got, glide gracefully through the light breeze. Royal mountains on the horizon guard the plains below sprawling with life. The beauty is unmatched in comparison to anything on Earth. Home has been found.
At what point would we, too, destroy this planet by injecting the air with a vial of toxic chemicals? At what point would the clouds become blackened and the only twinkle in the sky be that of chemical plant lights? At what point would exhaust pipes clip the wings of singing birds and take the lively planes until they were lifeless? You see, it's as if this planet knew what would happen to it, because the mountains began to sink into the ground, and the birds fled the scene. Molten lava rises from the core with a mission to engulf everything in sight, enough pondering. The only question remaining is, can we make it out in time?